In this video, I'm showing you how to download and install CapCut on PC, and this is a brand new updated method. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing to the channel. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like as well. We really do appreciate it. And please do watch the video right until the end to the full steps, and let's go and get straight into this. Here we are on my desktop, and let's go and get straight into this brand new method of downloading CapCut onto your computer. Things have changed quite a lot since last time, before you had to go and use emulators, that's all changed now and it's a lot easier. So all you need to do is open up the Microsoft Store on your computer, so to do that all you need to do is press on the magnifying glass just here, and then you want to go and search for Microsoft Store, just like so, it's already found it, so tap on it and here we are. Now something important to know is, is you may need to go and sign in to your Microsoft account to use the Microsoft Store if you haven't used it before. Um, but it's pretty easy, all you've got to do is sign into an account, I've already signed in here. Um, but to sign in, all you need to do is tap on the profile picture in the top right here and there'll be a sign in button, but I'm already signed in. Then once you've gone and signed in, all you want to do is go and click on the search bar and of course you want to go and search for CapCut. Just go and search for CapCut just like so, go and press search and it's just loading. And here it is, as you can see. So go and tap on it just like so. And this is a desktop version of CapCut. And then all you need to do is press install. And here it is, it's already installing. So as you can see, it's 300 megabytes and you can see your progress here. So I'll show you what to do next after it's finished downloading. So after it's finished downloading, it's now gonna go and switch to installing. And then it will start saying completed and then it will switch to installed. And as you can see, it just says installed. So now you can come and close off of the Microsoft Store. And as you can see, CapCut is now on my desktop. If it isn't on your desktop, don't worry. All you need to do is tap on the magnifying glass and go and search for CapCut just like so. And then you can go and tap on it and it's gonna go and open up. So here we are, CapCut is now launching and it currently says environment testing. And then once it's finished, it's gonna go and give you a result. And as you you can see it says for me your computer can run CapCut smoothly so I'll click confirm and now it's actually going to load and CapCut is just loaded just like that and all you need to do is go and press on start creating currently I've got no project so I'll click here and then it's going to actually go and launch the timeline as you can see here it is and then to go and get started all you need to do is press import and you can start importing videos and get editing if you found this video useful please go down below and consider subscribing to the channel leave a like for more peace